So the first place to place your hands right, is up just on the top of the head. And all doing is just um, feel that, that deep connection with, um, with the, the client's um, soul, the client's body, everything that encompasses it. is on top of the face like this you can do it like that yeah that's okay oh, sorry, so the, 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 the way that I do it is like that oh sorry. But it, but it, no that's alright it doesn't actually matter um, it's all personal so if that feels better for you then you can do that as well is the side, just like that. So be aware of the sensations you're feeling as well in your hands. It's all very cold. On both sides. Started on my left and now it's on both. But up my arms as well. And my arms weren't cold before I started. Mm. So is it going how far up your arms? Are, is um, it going? To sort of about an inch down from my elbow. This is the um, uh, the uh, the energy that the, the, the biosyn moving itself and filtering itself out, so it will. Will eventually move down mm -hmm. again. How does that feel, Anne? I like it. Yeah, it's very, very calm. Is there any particular area on your hands as well that you're feeling the coldness, or is it the whole of your hand? It's mainly fingertips and mm. around the sort of heel of my hand and on my right hand it's the back of my hand as well. Yeah, it can be around the back. It's, it's its way of trying to find its way through. So it's, um, and the sensation might change as well. Mm. It might start to um, to move down, say, um, a throbbing or, um, or a tingling or something along those lines as well. Okay, if you move your hand so that underneath the head um, okay, Ryan's he's doing the job for <laughs> us. Yeah, just like that. Okay. Okay, I'm going to move it out again now. Thank you. Okay, you move your hands to throat area and just hold it around just like that. Yeah, that's it. to the shoulders. Yep. <laughs> the right way is a comfortable way for you, so the yeah, that looks great. like that. Yeah. We can go in a bit further. Yeah, that's it. Or 
show you another alternative as well. If you're standing, okay. you can do it like that as well. I think I may have done it like that last week. Yeah. I can't remember. You, it, it'll vary depending on the situation. That's a good way if you're someone's sitting down. Yeah. So, um, but, uh, there's no can one wrong way. Can I get up and try that? Yeah. Okay. Does it matter which hand you have in front? No, not at all. And if you want to do hands off, so it won't sit, this won't show on the camera, but uh, it's just like this until you okay. feel that intensity is at its highest. And sometimes you'll just feel a resistance, like mm -hmm. there's something actually there when. When there is, it's the energy, but uh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Is, uh, right there, you can probably go back to uh, going hands on if you want to, and just keep okay. it as light as you can. So, um, as the body rises with each breath, your hands rise as well. It's like you're not even making any contact, but you are. Next is another hands with down, which is just there. If you're comfortable um, to do that, you can. But, um, either one is fine, or you can, can even do both. That's okay as okay. well. There. Yes. The, um, the joints an area where lots of biosin does pick up. Um, Pick up, build up is a better word than pick up. <laughs> um, this is one of the major areas as well. Is it okay to turn that hand so it's like that? Yes, you can. It's whatever's comfortable. It's, it's best. Now the next one is one that I've added in, which I've picked up over the, the years. And that's uh, one hand on the shoulder, another hand on the hand. I'm just going to move this so it can be seen. You can come around and repeat this on the other side. area you can you have a choice you can either do both of these together like so underneath the knees mm -hmm. um, like this or like this and like this that was completely up to you there's no right or wrong um, I kind of like the idea of this you can do the same on the other side as well
this is the end. You can finish on this spot here. And you have, again, you have a choice. You can either have both hands there like this underneath or do both individually like this. Because mm -hmm. um, some people just generally do one side. Um, it just depends on what the person needs. So, in, but in this case, um, actually do have a go doing this. I'd only just dismiss this and then okay, turn Anne over. Okay. And uh, back as well. Are you okay? Mm -hmm. Very nice. Oh, we're not going to send you over yet. Oh, sorry. <laughs> sorry. <laughs> just so you can get a feel of it. Do the other side as well. Just here, and the next one after that is that. Okay. These are ones that I, I kind of like. They're um, it's just on the back of the shoulder blades. This is an area which um, often people miss. And I don't know whether you know this, or come across this in massage, but this is an area where a lot of the um, the knots seem to end up. Yeah. It's along here, so um, yeah, that's that's quite important. Um, quite important area. Move to the next position. That's it. If you now move down to the next, that's it. We finish with Ken Yoku. And I'm just put my hands together and just give thanks. <laughs>